Hello, and welcome to another super duper super three boy blender tutorial. In today's tutorial, we're going to go over the grease pencil tool released in Blender 2.48a. Now, if you want to download the blend file for this tutorial, at the end, you can always go to nistic.com, click on the Blender 3D tab, you can download the blend files for all the tutorials, you can download them uh, for your offline viewing pleasure, or you can stream them in your browser at almost double the quality that YouTube offers. So, also, I'm releasing tutorials every week, so don't forget to subscribe if you're not already. So, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, we don't need our default cube today, so just erase him. Uh, we're going to go down here to the view and the grease pencil. And move that towards the center here. Uh, we're going to click use grease pencil. And we're also going to select the sketch in 3D. So basically, the uh, grease pencil combines the kind of power of Photoshop uh, in Blender, but in 3D. Kind of weird way to describe it, but that's the best I can do. So, for example, we can hold down Shift and our left mouse button and draw a circle okay cool you can sketch whoop de doo well you can also hit alt left mouse button rotate and shift left mouse button and sketch something else so I mean you can make little doodles in a uh, 3D space it's pretty cool great time waster so, you can also hit Alt, right mouse button, to delete the stuff, and you can just get rid of all of that. And let's try to show you how this works with an example. So, for example, uh, let's make a little cube, a little cube scene, uh, just something simple. And this is just used for rough drafting. Uh, whether it be animation, uh, trying to animate a character, you can quickly uh, just draw down uh, how you want it to look, or you can sketch out uh, a scene like I'm going to show you here, or uh, at the end of the tutorial I'll also show you, you can actually freehand in here and convert it to a mesh and use it straight into your scene. So. First thing we're going to do is go to the top view, and we're going to just draw a square, basically. But I like my thickness a little bit better, or bigger, so let's delete that, increase our thickness. That's better, nice and thick. And I'm just holding down shift left mouse button. Then from there... I'm going to select front view, go there, go to top view, go here, and I'm going to draw one of the sides of the cube. So go back into front view, shift left mouse button, bring it up, side, and down. That's basically one side of the cube right there. So. Uh, numpad 6, uh, if you're using laptop, FN, uh, O, or thereabouts, shift, whoops, alt, right mouse button, and just kind of draw it out here, see how that looks, looking good, uh, view, front view, rotate it, Again, numpad 6. Kind of get a view of where we are. And we want to put the cursor where we want our stuff to go. Uh, so it's in the correct orientation here. Okay, front view. And then shift, left mouse button. That drew it. 
Let's actually go back into front view. Rotate around. And complete this up. Perfect. So now we have a 3D sketch cube that we just made here. So let's also add kind of uh, a background, make it kind of into a scene. So let's go to top view, uh, drag a larger box around this one, and double check it. Looks fine. Uh, go to, we're going to draw uh, sides on two of these edges here. So get it quickly orientated. Zoom out. Shift. Left mouse button. Over here. 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 And I just drew a side. Let's also go front view. Up at six. Boom. Boom. And let's try to actually make that look a little bit better. And ta da. See how we made uh, just a simple uh, cube. Uh, in a kind of walled area here uh, just using the grease pencil tool and basically you can just use it to sketch out things like this uh, in 3D so uh, after you get a feeling of how you want your scene set up you can go ahead and stick in your cube and do your modeling and such also you can uh, convert to something like uh, a path, bezier, armature, do one of these, do an alt C, and it's a mesh now. And you can have all sorts of fun with that. So, I mean, with the new uh, grease uh, pencil tool, you can uh, plan out your scenes, uh, kind of sketch out what you want to do, or uh, with that convert to bezier and then. Uh, Alt C to convert to mesh, you can actually create little objects uh, carefully, emphasis on the carefully, and paste them uh, right into your scene. So I hope you uh, learned a little bit from this tutorial um, using the grease pencil tool, and I hope to see you guys in the next tutorial. This is Super 3 Boy out.